that we got a good baseline. Differences between dyno to dyno, different days, different temperatures, all don't matter because we can just look at changes we've made today. Now one of the changes we're going to make is a real simple easy change. Now the JLT performance kit we've got today, it's got a couple neat features. You can see this one's a carbon fiber look which is really nice, it's going to look cool in here. It's got all the factory hookups, you know, for PCV, the sound symposer, which the OE put in to actually pump some of those beautiful intake noises at the higher RPMs. We can hook all that up. And also what we're going to do is increase the diameter of the pipe. Now the stock one I think is about an 86 millimeter diameter. This one's about 112. So again, we can pick up a few ponies here as well as, you know, different mods down the road. We're already set up to just feed that air in. Now we're going to take the mass sensor and we're going to put it in here. This is a one piece construction, so there's no other little blob to put on there, which is nice. And it comes with a great air filter, nice radiuses on the inlet. You know, even got, you know, maximum use of air filter, let the air in there. So that's going to be an easy, you know, five minute job. Then we can go in there and add the tune, really start having some fun. All right, now you see how easy that was. Now to really make that mod come alive, we have a Diablo Sport in tune. Throw a couple tunes at it, really make it pop. Yeah, all right, welcome back. Now we've got our cold air intake kit in and we've swapped over our original mass sensor. Now a mass sensor can go into a hundred different applications, but it has to be calibrated for the airflow, the losses, the diameter of the tube of the system that it's going in. So we're gonna have to update this transfer function or calibration, and what's nice, we can take a simple device like this Diablo Sport Intune. It's a handheld controller, and we can go on a number of infinite lists of different combinations. Pick that one, download it, and it'll automatically update that calibration and transfer function, and it'll already do things like adding spark, changing the air fuel tables, shift points, speed points, so we can pick a tune and just download it and never have to get worried about picking up a laptop, messing something up, so it's real easy. So we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna hand this off to Willie, download this particular uh, calibration and start playing around and have some fun. So like Kev was saying, it's really simple. You plug it into your OBD2 port and you can change power, performance, drivability, all in the palm of your hand. Pulls up the vehicle's VIN number and you have all the tunes that are available. The great thing about Diablo Sport and Tune is they're constantly updating the tunes. So we see here, go through a bunch of the selections. We have JLT induction. That's the one that we want right there. And there we go. A 93 octane tune, we're going to hit download, and it's that simple. So now it's downloading the original tune, then it'll put our new calibration in, and then we can trap this thing back down on the dyno, do another pull, and see what kind of gains we made. All right, Kev, what we get? Oh, an easy 26 horsepower. <laughs> easy it was, nice. man. 26 like horsepower, it. very noticeable feel at the rear tires. You'll definitely like that at the pedal, too. Yeah. It's as easy as downloading a song and getting to listen to it all day. <laughs>